this is these are the parts that I bought these are the parts that I used I got Windows XP and uh, I also got some uh, thermal thermal goo I guess to help uh, keep some cooling down Here's my first PC build so so I'm liking my PC it's pretty good um, excellent actually so uh, there you go those are the parts if you're looking for it okay also EG has had an update I have not played like any games really except for Call of Duty trying to get my rank up and stuff like that so I could get all the items again because I have to I have to go get rank back. I lost all the items with the new PC and everything. Okay, so EG just had an update, I think. Uh, so I have not even been on Soldier Front. I don't even have the installed update. So let me just go ahead and talk about what we got here. New map mode, all random maps. Okay, great, whatever. Uh, hot random maps. Okay, great, whatever. <laughs> uh, new up in Drugnov. I guess this is here for everybody. I don't know the price. I don't know the rank stats or anything like that. I don't know if I can afford it. I probably can. Uh, so I guess if I can, I I will consider buying it. It might be something I buy and test out probably this episode. Okay, we'll see though. New feature, gifting feature, allows you to gift to your friends and family who are on your friends list. I guess you can gift them SP and items. That is great, I guess. But uh, one problem is going to be a lot of spammed accounts and a lot of problems like that. Maybe. I don't know how the system works exactly. New armor, that's great. Uh, just look into, like I said, look into that if you're looking for armor. Go out, you can read the, about those on your own. New item, special package. Uh, they said it gives you... Well, what did they say? Something like... Um, a new secret item in the crates. Okay, that's great. Uh, I don't know what that item is. I'm very sorry. Go ahead and check the forums, or ask on the forums for what that special gift is. Sorry, I have not looked into that. Um, I probably should have. Name, special package... New item special package gives you the following at a discounted price. Okay. So, well, there you go. You can just check that out if you want. This is all found on the EG forums, by the way. Um, okay. So, I guess I will go ahead and get on Soldier Front real quick. And let's go do that. Scratch that f uh, Soldier Front comment there. <laughs> Once again, here we go, editing, but, uh, yes, due to the magical world of editing, I, uh, it is now an hour or so later, well, not that much, but, um, I actually did record a good amount on Soldier Front, but, uh, it all didn't capture the video, so it's really kind of useless. Uh, really, I don't really have a reason to be on Soldier Front this episode anyway. I did have one question, but we'll see if, I, I don't know, we'll see if I play Soldier Front this video later or not. I'll, I plan on actually recording, uh, uh, later, because right now it's nighttime and nobody's on any games, and I can't find anybody to play with me. It's, I've got a lot I'm doing anyway, so I might as well just work on some other stuff ahead of time. Uh, but, um... There are a few questions that still need to be answered before I get on the game because I, I left those out also before I did this. Um, also, I cannot afford the dra Dragnov. I'm sorry. If you really want me to buy the Dragnov, there will be more information on this Donate tab up here. Just click that. More information on how you can donate to get me to you review the Dragnov for everyone. Um, okay. One question here, how do you download Special Force? Well, go to the forums, and this should be on the new, new ones also. Well, excuse me. Go to Soldier Front Non-Combat dis combat Discussion. Hopefully, Wabbit will post this information again. Um, or if somebody else posts it and gives original credit to Wabbit, whatever. Um, I'm sure if Wabbit posts it, though, I'll go ahead and leave that out there. Um, go to All Kinds of Soldier Front is what it's titled right here. I've never downloaded any foreign special force game and here's all the information you need 
I get well I mean it gives all the links to the home pages of those uh, special force sites I don't know what you uh, it requires to get to get it downloaded or anything like that but you know get more people to the forums and the more people we have the more knowledge there is that goes around so I'm sure somebody out there will know what steps you need to take to download these games and other stuff like that okay next question here what are your controls for Call of Duty 4 and 1942 alright well let's go over those Okay, Call of Duty 4. Look, invert mouse, yes. Uh, lean left to Z and right is C. Everything else unbound. Free look, yes. Smooth mouse, n no. Mouse sensitivity is relatively high. Um, movement, WSAD. Jumping is uh, space bar. Same goes uh, to stand, I guess. Uh, toggle prone is Q. So that and then uh, crouch is caps lock and that means I have to hold the caps lock button if I want to crouch I cannot just tap it and then I will be in the crouch position I don't like that um, combat uh, use the mouse buttons uh, melee is B or N because that's where my thumb sits and if I had more buttons on my mouse I'd probably use them as my knife attack but I don't so I don't use that as a knife attack um, Switch weapon is two or three. That's pretty much based. Uh, well, I pretty much base most of my uh, configurations off of 1942, Battlefield 1942. That's what I really got my start on, and I really like the way it's laid out. Everyone has different weapon configurations. Like some people started out playing tribes, so you know their jump button is like left mouse click, and their fire is space bar in all games, all kinds of crazy stuff. But um, okay. Sprint steady aim is uh, shift. I also have uh, an F to steady my sniper rifle because sometimes I'll be pressing caps lock or something to crouch when I'm sniping. So I need another button to do that. Fro throw frag is left, is middle mouse. Special grenade is tab. Grenade launcher and stuff is four. Air support and stuff is five and six. Interaction use E. Night vision, period, or comma, uh, show objectives, F4, multiply controls, uh, voice chat, K, talk, T, and Y, quick chat, I should probably put that at something like X or something like that, but I never really use it. Um, and that is it. Okay, let's go to call, uh, Battlefield. Okay, here we are at Battlefield. Um, Lots of controls here for common, enter, exit vehicle, E, parachute, left control. A lot of people have it at 9. I like it at control because I can just hit it really fast. I know where it is. Uh, usually people who have it at 9 have to, you know, they look at their keyboard and then press the 9 button. I just like having uh, that as just, I know where it is. I don't have to look. Show scoreboard tab. So spawn, enter, show map M, change the map N. Inside chase rear and front views. I should probably change. Uh, I think it's chase front and inside. I should probably change those to something more ac accessible, like uh, uh, Y, because when I'm flying and stuff like that, I would be able to uh, look behind, uh, uh, look behind myself, and then quickly get back. Uh, so I don't know what I should change those to. Probably Z and X. So I'll go ahead and do that now. Chase front Z inside X or whatever inside Z. Chase front X. That's why it's important. Uh, let me save that. Uh, anything else here really need to, needs to be talked about? Uh, not really. Uh, infantry. WSD moves. Uh, space is jump, walk is left shift, uh, drop or pick up kit is F, uh, fire 1, zoom is 2, uh, mouse buttons that is, reload R, next weapon I don't even use, um, weapon 1, they're all just set the same here, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, crouch is caps lock, prone is Q, inverted mouse CS yes on everything, um, for flying, it's pretty much all default. Yes, land and sea, I think it's all default. Yeah, except for my invert mouse and stuff like that.